We have been in southwestern Uganda, we have been in central Uganda, we have been in the east, and now we, are move, we have moved to Karamoja region, and thereafter we shall be in West Nile region. The National Community Health Strategy uh, was launched in February 2023, that was last year, and we are now at the stage of operationalization and implementation of this particular strategy. We have been working with Malaria Consortium for quite a long time, not only in these regions, Maria, we are working with the Maria Consortium in, in, in Buyikwe, we are also working with Maria Consortium in, in Tungamo, we are working with Maria Consortium in Acholi region, we have actually did that committed health workforce, but it is one of the implementing partners that are actually strategic in Karamoja region to focus on implementation and operationalizing this national community health strategy. You know, the leaders of Karamoja region, they are very happy that now the dissemination is going to take place. And when they heard of price development model, most of them thought that it is, it is the financial assistance that we are giving them from government. But for us, you know, our parish development model is based on what we call a social services pillar. And we have the elements of primary health care, including nutrition, including disease prevention, including they are very happy that now the dissemination is going to take place. And when they heard of parish development model, most of them thought that it is, it is the financial assistance that we are giving them from government. But for us, you know, our parish development model is based on what we call a social services pillar. And we have the elements of primary health care, including nutrition, including you know, disease prevention, including, you know, hygiene. Most of them, are, these services are lacking at parish and we are activated. We are going in there in operationalizing the national community strategy because we, it has seven strategic directions, which we call pillars. We are focusing on you know, having a community health that has access to community health services, both at facility and the community. We are also focusing on having a community health that has a well-digitized community health workforce that is professionalized. And we are also helping a community health workforce that has a proper supply chain system with sustainable financing for health and also has coordinated leadership. And we are also aligning this particular community health strategy with the parish development model, which is the social services pillar. And these pillars, we know, are all the pillars and the building blocks for community health services and health services. Moja region is a very good place and it's a very fertile place for uh, implementing some of these strategies, some of the community health strategies we have, uh, because it is more or less an area where health services have been confirmed to be poor, but we are now activating health services at parish level. We are moving in depth to the, to the levels up to the village levels. We are also trying as much as possible to activate services at sub-county level. We are focusing on having elements of primary health care activating both at the district and sub-county including the parish level. We are also activating the sub-county task forces, activating village task forces so that we can actually improve on the service delivery in this respect. We are moving forward to communities to prevent diseases. We will identify the diseases quickly. If, if the disease is already there, we do what we call community referrals to facilities. We use our community health workforce within those particular communities. We are trying as much as possible to pull resources. We are using native partners within the particular districts to focus on implementing this particular national community health strategy. And all these work plans are aligned to what we call a national community health strategy. And now that we have the very good model, the parish development model, which is backing up services at parish level, this will be made very available.